are not even going to believe all the stuff I just got at this Goodwill. Oh my goodness. Hi guys, my name is Destiny and I am a full-time reseller on eBay and on Poshmark. And today I just had the best thrift haul ever. And I'm saying that because I found a ton of Lululemon and that's my all-time favorite brand to sell, but I got so much of it and I got some really good stuff and everything was literally amazing in one thrift store. So I'm really excited to show you guys and do a little thrift haul of what I picked up and things that you could definitely pick up as well. I'm gonna be showing you guys everything as I am taking the tags off. So let's just get right into it. I'm so excited. First thing I found is this brand, which is new to me. It's called Packed. They're a pair of women's kind of like cargo pants. Packed, I looked it up. It's a really great brand. Might be men's and women's, but these are some women's like cargo pants. Really excited to um, find these. The sell-through rate was pretty good. As you'll probably be able to sell these um, for about $30, $35 if you find the brand Packed, P-A-C-T. Really great brand. Next is the brand American Eagle. I love picking up American Eagle men's jeans, women's jeans. I also like picking up the men's um, shorts. Shorts will do really good for the summer, but I also have really good luck with these. Um, they're classic fit pants or the long board shorts. Sell really well. They're not gonna sell for a ton, um, but they will sell for about $25, which is great bread and butter for me. Okay, next we have our first Lululemon piece. I found like three or four of these, of these men's Lululemon joggers. They might be, I don't know what the name of it, they might be called the Surge Joggers, but they're all a size 2XL, which is a great size. This is a great style. These will sell probably, I don't know, between $50 and $60. And I found a couple pairs of them. So I'm super excited. I cannot wait to get these listed. Then we have the brand called Peter Millar. Peter Millar is a great men's and women's like outdoor golf brand this is the tag i know it might be backwards um but this is like a men's half zip really really nice these sell really great for me it's a size 2xl great size i will probably um sell this between 35 maybe 40 dollars so if you find pita malar in the men's pants or shorts or their half zips always sell really well especially for the summertime then i picked up the brand um tommy bahama i like picking up tommy bahama in their like performance shorts and pants so these are um let's see it's a so these are a polyester blend and it's a bigger size they're really nice really nice material i thought they would do really great for the summer so again i do like picking up the tommy bahama shorts and pants when it's like that polyester spandex material or also anything linen i like picking up as well um so these i should probably sell between um, 25 and 30 dollars then i picked up the brand under armor i do like picking up under armor in the men's shorts pants and some of their polos if it's a bigger size but these are a really nice pair of men just athletic performance wear shorts they're like basically brand new um, so i should probably be able to sell these between 20 and 25 dollars and everything that i got today i paid um four dollars and 80 cents with tax here we go another pair same thing these lululemon um joggers great size 2xl still has the nice clean tag in it really really excited about these again probably between 50 and 60 dollars if you find lululemon and it's anything in men's sells really well women's their leggings anything that you could tell is kind of newer will sell really well then this is another pair of the under armor shorts again i picked up a couple pairs of these they're really nice basically in brand new condition and it's a great size a 2xl so again i should probably get between 20 and 25 dollars for those i definitely love picking up things that i can sell quickly in between the 20 to 25 price point um those are kind of like my bread and butter items so i love picking up those lower items that i can as well next we have i was so excited to find this this is lily pulitzer and they're a women's like super it's kind of hard to see super wide leg i think they're linen pants in a great size extra large lily pulitzer I was so excited. This is a great brand, especially for the summertime, basically all year round. But if you find Lily Pulitzer and you can get it for a good price, because usually Lily Pulitzer is like 
they upcharge it. These were not, surprisingly, so I was happy about that. Um, but these should sell really well. I'm going to say between, I don't know, $35 and $45. So great pickup. Next, I found the brand called Sigrid Olsen. Um, I always try to stick to this only in linen. If you find their linen pants or their linen tops, um, plus size definitely is going to increase the price. This is a size large. I've sold these before. They sell between $20 and $25. So I do love picking up Sigrid Olsen in their linen pants. They're like a, a linen wide like pants, so that'll sell well for the summer. Okay, next I found, again, American Eagle. These are a pair of American Eagle men's um, cargo shorts. Their cargo shorts do sell really well. I like picking them up. Again, I can get between, I would say 25, maybe closer to $30. Anything in cargo shorts or pants is selling really great right now. So this was a good pickup. Then we have a golf brand. It's called Jamie Sadock. I love picking up, sorry, I'm trying to show you the tag. I love picking up this brand. It's not gonna sell for a ton, but the women's pants and their shorts and their Bermuda shorts will sell between $25 and $30. So if you find the brand Jamie Saddock, it's a good women's and men's, but usually I only find the women's um, golf shorts. Next we have another pair of these Tommy Bahama like polyester nylon shorts. Again, Tommy Bahama is a great brand to sell, especially in the summertime. Um, and I'm hoping these shorts will do really well, so between $25 and $30 for these. I found a lot of like duplicates of things, which for me is great, because if it's a great brand and you find multiple of it, that's like the jackpot, especially with Lululemon. There's another pair, Tommy Bahama, really nice. All of these are, again, like brand new condition, so it was like I cannot leave them behind, so. Again, 25, 30 bucks for these. I'm trying to go a little fast because I do have a lot of stuff. Let's see, this is my receipt. This is my receipt, guys. Woohoo! Look at that. Let's see how many items I got. Let me count it up really quick. Forty-five things now in one store week is starting off great all right another pair of tommy bahama shorts these are a nice black pair will do really well lululemon again this is the same thing actually these are not joggers these are the lululemon just like regular straight leg pants i don't know what they're called you can always look up the style name with lululemon this has the rib tag size 2xl but if you look on the inside of one of the pockets generally it will have um like a number around it or some letters. And if you look that up, then you should generally always be able to find the style name and that'll help you when you are listing the item to know what it is and it'll also increase the value. So again, these probably get, I would say between 50 and $60. Then we have Under Armour. These are the men's Under Armour shorts. They're like the polyester performance blend. Again, I do like picking up Under Armour in their shorts, in their pants, they sell really well these should probably get between 25 and 30 dollars then we have a brand i had not heard about a lot of the stuff i got like off the new rack it's called tucker nook tucker nook this is the tag um it's a really pretty i think it's like a linen blend women's dress when i looked it up it was a really great brand um this dress was sell not this specific dress but the dresses were selling um, anywhere from 50 to like $200. So this is a really great brand. If you find it, Tucker Nook, definitely a brand worth looking up and most likely getting. And this is new with tags. Next, we have the brand called Diane Von Furstenberg. I have really been liking this brand. It's a, this is just a women's, I think it's like a tunic top. It's a size medium, but it looks like a size extra large 2XL. So I think it's just supposed to be oversized. Um, but Diane Von Furstenberg, some of their pieces will do really well. Um, they can sell between anywhere between 30 and up to $100. So if you find this brand, definitely worth looking up and most likely getting. Then I found, this is a brand called Cooley Bar, which is great for all year round, but especially for the summertime. They make like UPF and sunwear protection dresses, um, half zip shirts. It's a really great women's brand. So this will do really well for the summer. It's called Cooley Bar. Cool i bar so if you find this i should be able to sell this probably for about 30 35 dollars 
um, the dresses are gonna do really great for the summertime. Next we have a brand new to me, it's called Dixie. I was trying to look up comps, D-I-X-I-E. It's a really pretty like maxi tiered dress. Um, and I saw, not I couldn't find this exact dress and I couldn't find exact comps, but the brand, some of the dresses were listed for like $100, $200. Um, so I'm gonna take a chance on it. I'm gonna do some more research and see what I can find. If you guys have heard of this brand, let me know, but I'm definitely, I should at least be able to double my money on this, hopefully. Then we have American Eagle. This is women's American Eagle. I love picking up American Eagle jeans, especially their flare and their boot cut because those are things that are in style right now. So these are called the mom jean. This, this is just a straight jean, um, but I can get about $25 for these. This is packed. Again, I found two pairs of these women's um like cargo wide leg pants i should be able to sell these i was i think between 30 and 35 dollars again it was a new brand to me but comps um were doing really well so i picked them up and i can't wait to sell them next we have the brand simply guys this was a newer brand to me as of like um, I would say about two months ago. It's S-Y-M-P-L-I and I started picking it up because the comps were doing really well and every time I pick these up I've sold at least like I think six or seven pairs already and they never sit in my store for long like a couple days a week two weeks max simply is a really great brand it's like a women's like pull on kind of like Chico's Travelers but um, like that's the style. They're just really like casual stretch pull on pants. These sell between um, 30 and $40 and these ones have pockets. Um, so I should be able again to get between, I'm going to say like $35, $40 for these. So if you find the brand simply definitely pick it up. Then I found Joseph Ribkoff, another really great brand that I love finding. They make women's, um, pants and tops, all different colors and styles but joseph ripkoff is a great brand to pick up if you can find it um i would say it could be style based as well they make like asymmetrical tops i just picked up one um so these should probably be able to sell between 35 and 45 dollars then i picked up the brand ll bean which i don't pick up really anything in ll bean but i was looking up um, comps for this specific style on these LL Bean women's like cargo pants and they were selling between $25 and $30. They're a bigger size, size 12. So again, I, I don't ever try to like discount any brand completely because there are some things that are style based, that are season based. Um, so if you look up comps and you can find the style name, it might be a great style to pick up. So I picked up a couple pairs of these and I should be able to get between $25 and $30. This is just another same pair, a brown pair again of LL Bean. These I think are selling really great right now because it's the summertime, people are going out, hiking. So these will do really well. This is a newer brand to me. It's a dress, it's called, honestly, this is really embarrassing, but I'm really bad at reading cursive. So I really don't know what this says, but it says by Brian Lars, which so I looked up Brian Lars and it's a really great brand. Um, some of their dresses were selling between like $100 and $200. So I was like, I'm just gonna take a chance on this. It's like a really pretty like women's dress. Um, again, I don't know, I'm gonna do some more research on this and look it up, but I think it should sell for at least $50. You have Eileen Fisher. I love picking up Eileen Fisher. This is an Eileen Fisher women's dress. It's a really pretty, um, just like black kind of striped dress. It's really like lightweight. It doesn't have the, uh, the size tag in it, but I think it's like a, an extra large. Um, so Eileen Fisher is a really great brand, especially in the plus sizes. If you ever find like 1X, 2X, 3X, huge bolo, but I do like picking up Eileen Fisher and pretty much anything, it'll sell really well. Okay, now we have another really great brand that I love selling. It's called Roan, and I don't find it a ton, but it's a really great men's um, athletic brand, kind of like Lululemon is what it looks and feels like a little bit. It's R-H-O-N-E. Um, these are just a pair of like a casual men's shirt. So if you find this brand, definitely pick it up. This shirt should probably sell between $30 and $35. And I also picked up another Roan, men's Roan shirt as well. This is a size large. Really great brand. So between $30 $35. Then, find of the day, I almost fell on the floor. For me, like, this has never happened 
I can't believe this. This is Lululemon, new with tags, guys, new with tags. So this is called the ABC Pull-On Pant, retail $128, men's size 2XL, and I found them new with tags. It's just beautiful. Like that has never happened to me. I was so excited, I could not believe it. That's like the ultimate, for me, like that's my ultimate find. And I know some of you guys are probably like, what? <laughs> but for me, it really is. I just love this brand. So, I mean, I'm hoping to get at least $100 for these pants. Then we have the brand J. Jill. I love picking up J. Jill. It's a great women's brand. They make pants, dresses, really anything. This is a women's like um, gauzy dress, button front dress. Um, Bolo, if you find it in plus sizes, kind of like Eileen Fisher, um, but I kind of pick it up in anything. This dress would probably sell between $30 and $35 for me. Then I picked up the brand Soft Surroundings. This is like a women's brand, and these are a pair of women's um, like Bermuda denim jean shorts, size petite, medium. I thought they would do great for the summer. Um, I'll probably get between $20 and $25 for these, but if you find soft surroundings and particular things, they make women's like really pretty midi and maxi length dresses. If you find it in the plus sizes, it's a bolo as well. Um, so soft surroundings is a good brand, kind of style base and what you have. This was Soft Surroundings again, new with tags, Soft Surroundings this time, another pair of like women's pull-on shorts. And these are new with tags, so that's a no-brainer. Um, I should maybe get between $35 and $45 for these shorts. Next we have, I also found Tommy Bahama, new with tags. So these, this is a pair of men's Tommy Bahama like performance chino pants, new with tags. So I found a couple things new with tags today. I was really excited. Um, so these I could probably sell, I'm gonna say between 40 and $50, if not more for these men's like really nice Tommy Bahama pants. Size 38 by 30, really great size too. This is Tommy Bahama again, men's, but these are 100% linen. So I thought these would do really great for the summer. Again, if you find Tommy Bahama, linen or they're they just like look and feel nice definitely give it a look up 100 linen i should probably get between 30 and 35 dollars for these then i found j jill this is called pure jill affinity french terry slim leg so sometimes they have like the style name on the inside of the tag which is really great this is a size small but i still picked it up it's really nice feeling it has pockets um, i should still be able to get between at least $25 and $30 for these. And because I can get them at a lower price, I'm gonna pick it up. Then I found Lululemon again, but these are the Lululemon men's shorts. I think these are called the Pacebreaker shorts. They're unlined, they're a size 2XL, nice little tag still in there. Um, so I should be able to get, I'm gonna say, between $35 and $45 for these shorts. I found them all in a really great size, so that's gonna help sell them as well. Then I found St. John, and I don't find this brand a lot, and I don't know a ton about it, but it's called St. John Caviar. It had like the name on the inside. So they're just a pair of like casual pull-on pants. Um, and I know St. John can be a really great brand, especially depending on like the type of things that you find. But I looked these up and these were selling between $35 and $45. So if you find the brand St. John, I definitely know it can be a huge bolo depending on what you have. All right, last bag. I found well, a lot of Tommy Bahama, another pair of Tommy Bahama. This is women's. All the ones I found previously have been men's. These are a pair of women's um, like floral beige pants. They're new with tags. Where's the tag? The tag is right here, but I'm realizing there is a hole on the back. Can you guys see this little hole? Actually, it's kind of big. So that stinks. Um, I'm still gonna try and sell them. That's the thing with new with tags. Even if you find stuff and you get really excited and it has the tags on it, it's there still could be defects, there still could be holes or stains. So definitely always look everything over. So I could have got probably $35, $45 for these, but I'll probably list them low now, try to get them sold because it does have that hole on it. So we will see, but otherwise it would have been great to pick up without the hole. Next I found, I forgot, like I literally just got home like 30 minutes ago and I already forgot all the stuff that I found, I'm so excited. Vineyard Vines, new with tags. 
So this is a pair of women's like super wide leg linen pants. They're a size large. They're called the wide leg linen pull on pant. So I should be able to get, I'm gonna say between um, 40, $45 for these. These will sell really great for the summertime. So if you find vineyard vines, I like picking up um, men's vineyard vines, like their pants and their shorts, performance wear, sometimes they're buttoned down. It's a great brand to definitely look out for. Next, I found Patagonia. Patagonia is a really great men's and women's outdoor like hiking brand. These are a pair of men's shorts. Here's like the logo right here. So definitely a really great brand. Some things in Patagonia can be a huge bolo with their shorts if you find the baggy shorts. Really great. Um, so definitely I'll pick up anything in Patagonia. I'll probably get between $35 and $40 for these. This is just another pair of those LL Bean women's like cargo pants. They have them in a bunch of different colors. So I picked them up. Again, probably between $25 and $30 for these. Okay, and then lastly is the brand called Page. I don't pick up everything in Page, but these are called the Page Federal Jeans, and this is men's. So I do like picking up this style in jeans. Um, you can find Page Federal Jeans, or if you find Page in like something boot cut, wide leg, flare, I would definitely give it a look up. Um, I have sold these in the past. I should be able to get between $30 and $35 for these men's jeans. All right, I feel like we did that pretty quickly. We went through 45 items. So that's everything that I got at that thrift store. Not expecting that. I love when that happens. Everything that I found, I was so excited. So I'm really excited now to get it pictured and get it listed and get it sold. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you have heard of any of these brands or some of the brands that were newer to me, if you've heard of them, leave me a comment and let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. You can like and subscribe if you would like to see more content and videos like this. And I will see you guys on the next video. Thanks.